Hi, this is Nicholas Vardy, editor of Oxford Swing Trader and contributor to libertythroughwealth.com. Today, I want to talk to you a little about lessons from today's market wizards. Ask the world's best traders what book inspired them the most, and one choice stands head and shoulders above the rest. And that book is Jack Swigger's Market Wizards, Interviews with Top Traders, published back in 1989. Schrager's book inspired an entire generation of traders to try their hand at trading for a living. I recently read Schrager's sixth book, Unknown Market Wizards, The Best Traders You Never Heard Of. These traders are not Forbes 400 billionaires like the original market wizards, like Paul Tudor Jones, Bruce Kovner, and Stan Druckenmiller. Instead, Schrager focused on top traders who work in relative obscurity. And as a group, these traders learned trading the hard way earning their trading spurs in small proprietary trading firms. Among them are Jason Shapiro, who turned an initial account of $2,500 into 50 million. Richard Varg, who achieved an average annual return of 280% over a four and a half year period. Peter Brandt, a former ad executive, who used classical chart analysis to achieve a 58% average annual return over a 27 year trading span. The stories of this new generation of market wizards also highlights the eternal truths of what it takes to be a successful trader. The 11 traders interviewed in the book each approached the market in their own unique way. Yet the secrets of successful trading overlap with those that Schrager found in the original market wizards from 30 years ago. At first blush, this may be surprising. After all, today's financial markets are far more competitive and driven mostly by algorithmic and high frequency trading. As it turns out, the lessons of today's traders reflect eternal truths about trading. And these lessons are worth revisiting. Lesson number one, there is no single path to making money in the markets. There is no holy grail. The paths that today's market wizards took to achieve their exceptional performance varied widely. Some studied at the world's best universities. Others were even high school dropouts. Their strategies ranged from fundamental to technical analysis to a combination of both. Their average holding periods ranged from minutes to months. Their trading success was not about their background or finding a single approach to trading. It was about finding the right approach for them. Lesson number two, you need to find your own trading approach. Now you can have access to the best trading systems in the world, but if those systems are inconsistent with your beliefs, you won't be successful trading it. Some traders find a single method that works for them and they stick with it for a lifetime. Others continually evolve. No one can tell you what you, the best approach for you is. You must adopt the methodology that works for you. Lesson number three, you need to know your edge. Unsuccessful traders invest on a whim or feeling. There's little method to their madness. Put another way, they lack an edge. If you don't know what your edge is, then you don't have one. Now that edge may be to buy and hold Warren Buffett's Berkshire Hathaway forever or it can be a quantitative system that generates trades like the ones behind my VIP trading service, Oxford Swing Trader. Knowing your edge is critical to identifying what to focus on among all the infinite number of possibilities of trading. Lesson number four, risk management is critical. Each successful trader stresses the critical importance of risk management. Sure, risk management isn't as sexy as devising a trade entry strategy, but it is essential to become a successful trader. The most critical aspect of risk management is position sizing. Always calculate how much you're willing to lose on each bet before you start trading. And you must manage your risk in your individual positions and you must manage your risk in your overall portfolio. Remember, your primary objective is to live to trade another day. Lesson number five, human emotions are the enemy of successful trading. Emotions will very often lead traders to do precisely the wrong thing. Traders know that they are their own worst enemy. Your psychology is a never ending minefield. You must guard against impulsive trades. Trades motivated by, by fear or greed end badly. Don't try to make money back in the same market you lost it in. Guard against sloppy trading after big winning streaks. So there you have it. These are five of the most important lessons from today's top traders. In my VIP trading service, Oxford String Trader, I have incorporated each of these principles into my approach. Oxford Swing Trader is based on a rigorously tested set of systems with a proven edge. Each recommendation comes with a carefully calculated stop price to limit your risk. And as a quantitative system, it takes human emotion out of the trading decision-making process. 
Like the market wizards interviewed in Schrager's books, I can't guarantee that all of my swing trade recommendations will be winners. But when I do get it right, you could see huge double digit gains over a short period of time. An auction swing trader recommends an average of two swing traders every single week. So you'll have plenty of opportunities, about 100 a year in fact, to generate quick gains using swing trading methods. So join me at Oxford Swing Trader. You can call our sales team at 888-570-9830 to learn more.